You know, when I was a decoy, I was mugged 500 times. I used to put myself in harm's way to make the streets a better place and to get to the truth of things. I lived and breathed being a cop and a detective. I loved it. I loved helping people. Those are the same things that made America what it is today. We help those who have less, and you have the freedom to speak without retribution. My name is Bo Deedle. I'm a retired detective for the New York City Police Department. I served on the police force for 15 years. I never backed down from anything or anybody. No matter what I've done, I've always had one mission, to uncover the truth. I started talking to ex-subway employees and got their side of the story. I hear that you used to work in one of these subway shops. Yes, I did. How long did you work there? I worked there for eight months. What did you actually do there? Well, I actually consider myself to be a sandwich artist extraordinaire. Do you slice meat in the back of the restaurant? Already comes pre-packaged. <laughs> did you ever slice anything on that slicer? No, I, I didn't. And now, when I think about it, I don't think there is a slicer. You ask most people where they think Subway slices their meat, most of them will tell you... In the back. In the back. Like behind the counter someplace. In the back. In the store, in the back. I've never seen meat sliced. I assume they slice it in the store, in the back. They cook it and slice it. Hopefully in the back. Hopefully. Where is it sliced? I'm going to show you where it's sliced. Taxi! <laughs> Take me to the airport! Arby slices their meat fresh every single day in every single restaurant by real human beings. It's something they've been doing since 1964. It's not the most cost-effective way, but they think it's the right way. A lot of Americans think that Subway slices up their meat in the back of the store. They don't. I want to know exactly what they do, where they slice it, when they slice it, and I want people to know. Where am I? So this is the back, huh? After all that, this is where Subway slices the meat. That's a long walk for a turkey sandwich. <laughs> Hello. I notice you guys don't have a meat slicer. No, we don't. Normally, a sandwich shop slices their meat, right? We don't have a meat slicer. I brought you one. Ah. I'm gonna leave this slicer right here. No charge to you. Okay, thank you. You know what? Slicing up the truth about freshness is hard work. I had my first Arby's roast beef sandwich in 1969, California. My sister moved out there, and I flew out there to visit her, and I was starving. I said, what are we gonna eat? She goes, you like roast beef? I said, I love roast beef. She goes, well, there's a place called Arby's. I never heard of Arby's. I'll never forget the taste of it. And they slice the roast beef thin, so when you bite into the sandwich, it like kind of melts in your mouth. It was so delicious. Hey, Arby's. Arby's roast beef.